Hey, what's up, Doc and fam, and welcome back to All the Hermanity. In today's video, I'm going to show you how to boost the super attack of the newest Vegeta unit, Rapid Clash Super Saiyan Vegeta, without using any Elder Kai's. But before we get started, make sure you click that subscribe button, as well as the notification bell, so you never miss a new video upload from me. Alright guys, so there's actually a few different ways you can boost super attack of this unit for free before you get him to the TUR level. And now if you don't know who this man TUR is into, it's God Vegeta, obviously from the Broly movie. Guys, we have been waiting for so long for Super Saiyan God Vegeta. We finally got him and man, he delivers. This unit is absolutely amazing. Leader skills, super strength type key plus three, HP attack and defense plus 100%. Super attack, big bang attack, sir, uh, greatly raises attack and causes supreme damage to enemy. And then his passive skill, guys, key plus three in attack and defense plus 100%, as well as a high chance of guarding all attacks and a high chance of stunning the attacked enemy when there's a movie boss's category enemy. So this unit, along with the new God Goku on the same team going after the new Broly event, is probably going to do some devastating damage. You guys should definitely check it out and give it a try. So, how do we boost Super Attack for free? Well, there's a few different ways you can do it, like I said. So, what we're going to do is we're going to go over to the game really quick because I want to show you something directly on the banner. Now, on the banner, it lists all the units that you can summon. While summoning on this banner... Obviously, you're going to get some SIs. And this unit right here, Inherited Honor, Super Saiyan Vegeta, you can utilize every single one of these as a 50% chance to boost the super attack of your god Vegeta, but in his base form, guys. You can't have these units TUR'd. They have to be in their SSR or UR form before you dock and awaken them, okay? Or TUR them. So, here we go. Let's jump right into it. Let's go to our training screen. We're going to select Vegeta right here, and if we click on training partners, you're going to instantly see what's going on. So you got this unit right here, which I just showed you, um, Inherited Honor Super Saiyan Vegeta. In the SI level, he's a 5% chance, but when you get him to the UR level, I mean the SSI level, he becomes 50%. And then any other SSI Super Saiyan Vegeta that you pull, okay, that can be UI'd, will become a 100% chance. So for example, um, I pulled this Vegeta. I don't need him. I'm gonna get him to the UR level and it's gonna be a 100% increase for my super attack. Uh, oh, I also pulled one of these Vegetas. This is Int um, Last Minute Technique Super Saiyan Vegeta. Any Super Saiyan Vegeta can be used. However, when it's an SI, all you can do is get it to SSR and then it's 50%. And if I scroll down to the bottom, um, there's some other Vegetas that obviously I have locked because I'm not going to get rid of them. And this one right here, this is actually, I believe this is the TUR of the one I just showed you. Yes, it is. Um, so he's maxed out. I'm not going to get rid of him. And then this Vegeta right here can also work. And then this Vegeta right here works as well. Any Super Saiyan Vegeta works. And then in order to get him to SI to SSI, you're going to have to awaken and it's going to cost some Zenny. So let's click on the unit real quick. So the unit that you're going to get, the SR Vegeta from the banner, it's going to cost you 20 Bubbles Medals, 10 Mr. Popos, 5 Bobbities, and then 1 North Kai. But as soon as you do that, you click Awaken, it's going to cost you 560,000 Zenny. Boom, SSR, 50% chance. Now there is another way to do it. And it's only going to cost you Stamina and some Medals to do it this way. But guys, like, it took me almost two full buys of stamina to pull one of these units okay so i do not recommend doing it unless uh, for whatever reason on your docking account you have better luck than me but guys my stamina is 190 the event to get this unit is power at the pinnacle stage one on zihad it costs 10 stamina that means it took what 30 almost 36 times for me to get one unit, okay? So at 10 apiece, one bar of stamina, that's 19 tries on one bar of stamina, didn't get anything. Next bar of stamina, I pulled one. But it can be done, so if you like to grind, you don't have other Kai's, you don't have a choice, well, you have a choice. So this is Willing to Fight Super Saiyan Vegeta, and then obviously you're gonna have to get him to the SSI level before you dock and awaken him. Uh, and in order to do that, it's gonna cost you uh, 20 Dr. Giro medals, 
10 Grandpa Gohans, uh, 5 Corn Medals, and then 1 Kabito Kai Medal. As soon as you do that, he'll become a 50% increase, um, but you do not want to dock and awaken him using power at the Pinnacle Medals, because then he becomes uh, a Dark Super Saiyan Vegeta, but Super Saiyan Vegeta Angel, and that's not going to work as an increase for the Super Attack, so you're going to want to stick with just the regular one at 50% to increase that super attack, which I think is probably better. You're going to save a lot of Zenny and a lot of metals that way and a lot of time if you do pull them. So that's what you're going to do. And guys, whenever you're boosting a super attack, I mean, like, yeah, it might seem like a bit of a grind to get these units from SI to SSI, but at the end of the day, if you don't have a lot of LIs, you will get them in time, and you're going to wish that you saved every single Elder Kai you've ever gotten to get their super attacks from 10 to 20. It's very important. So take advantage. If you have obviously got this unit, it means you summoned for him, and you got these other Vegeta units as well. So use them. Use them as a 50% increase. And if you didn't see my other video I just did on how to increase the super attack of the Goku that was also on that banner, which is this unit right here, Make sure you check out that video. I'll link to it at the end of this one. I hope you guys have a great night. Be sure to hit that like and subscribe button if you enjoyed the video. And as always, more good stuff coming soon. See you guys.